All right, guys, it's Haley. Back, we're gonna clean our instrument, our imp implement. So today we're cleaning our nail brush. I have this cute little sealed container that we're gonna use. And we're gonna begin by bringing it to our sink and then locating the cleaning solution, which today we're using Dawn. Um, follow the manufacturer's instructions for the cleaning solution, which for Dawn is basically warm water, lather, rinse. So I have my warm water in my container and my Dawn. And I'm gonna fully submerge my implement into my container and wash it. Scrubbing to make sure we remove all of the debris. All right, so it's all nice and clean. And we're gonna rinse our implement in warm running water. Drying with a clean towel. And we're going to also rinse our container and dry that as well. And we dry that just so that we don't dilute the barbicide when we use it. So that is clean. Next thing we're gonna do is locate our disinfectant. Um, and for today we're using pine salt, but this is actually gonna be, we're gonna pretend this is barbicide. And I am going to read the label and locate the EPA registration that says that this is in fact bactericidal, vericidal, and fungicidal and registered by the EPA. Then I'm gonna read the directions that tell me to mix this with two ounces of barbicide and 32 ounces of water. I'm actually gonna reduce that down a little bit because my container is not that big. So I'm gonna use one ounce of barbicide and 16 ounces of water. Still have soap in my face here. All right, so in order to use this, we have to follow the directions and the guidelines of the manufacturer's label, which states that we're protective gear. So I am gonna put gloves on my hands, as well as safety goggles on my eyes. And we're going to begin by filling our water. So I have a two cup. I have a two cup measuring cup, which is 16 ounces. And we're going to pour that into the container. And then I have my barbicide. And we're going to use one ounce of barbicide. And pour that into our water. Then we are going to completely immerse, just lifting that up so you guys can see there, the nail brush or the implement into the disinfectant. We're going to seal that in a closed container and that will sit for 10 minutes according to the manufacturer's directions. All right, timer went off and we're all set. It's been in for 10 minutes. So the first thing we're gonna do is remove the lid and remove the implement. We're gonna rinse this in hot water. And then thoroughly dry it. With the clean disposable paper towel. All 
right, implement nice and dry. Now we're going to get rid of this disinfectant here. We're going to go ahead and dry this container out. Place the implement into the container, seal it, and put it into dry storage. Then we're going to remove our protective gear.